Welcome to the Getting Started with Terraform Enterprise Guide. This is a guided tutorial to set up Terraform Enterprise and enable a team of operators to collaboratively provision infrastructure. Navigate to hashicorp.com slash go slash Terraform dash enterprise. Provide your email, first name, last name, and company information. You'll soon receive a link from your sales account manager prompting you to complete the registration process. Click the link, then enter your email address, desired username and password, then click create an account. You'll receive an automated email to the account you registered with asking you to confirm your email. Click the hyperlink inside the email and in your browser you'll be logged into Terraform Enterprise. Now that you've logged into Terraform Enterprise, you'll be prompted to create a new organization. Organizations in Terraform are a shared space for teams to collaborate on workspaces. Enter an organization name and email address. The organization name can be any name to your liking as long as it wasn't already taken by another trial user. A success message will be presented with the option to create a new workspace. Before creating a workspace, we'll perform a few other administrative tasks. Version control system integration is a key part of working with Terraform Enterprise. In order to get started, first navigate to OAuth configuration under Organization Settings and click Add OAuth Client. Next, select your VCS provider in the dropdown and follow the instructions according to your VCS provider, referencing the documentation in the Getting Started Guide. After following the instructions for your VCS and clicking the Connect Organization button, you will see a list of OAuth clients. You may connect to one or more VCS sources from Terraform Enterprise. Workspaces are how Terraform Enterprise organizes infrastructure. A workspace consists of a collection of Terraform configurations retrieved from a VCS repo, values for any variables those configurations require, and persistent stored state for the resources the configuration manages. First in the UI, navigate to the Terraform Enterprise homepage and click the Add New Workspace button. Enter a workspace name, select a VCS repository, and click the Create Workspace button. A success message will appear at the bottom of the screen and you'll receive a prompt to configure variables, which will be discussed in the next section. Click the Configure Variables button, then click the Edit link next to the radio button corresponding to the Terraform variable or environment variable you'd like to edit. Click Save to save the contents of your variable and you should receive a success message at the bottom of the screen. To collaborate with your colleagues in Terraform Enterprise, each engineer will need access to the same Terraform Enterprise organization. First, each user should self-register to Terraform Enterprise as described in step one of this guide. Then, under Organization Settings, click Teams. Enter a team name like Prod, AWS, Dev, Azure, or any name to your liking, and then click Create Team. You should receive a success message and the resulting screen, which invites you to add users to the team. Add users to the team by entering their Terraform Enterprise username and clicking Add User. You should again receive a success message upon adding each user. 